down to John Roberts. John. Field by Florida Gulf Coast Junior Mariah Fernandez, who had the big double in the third inning to drive home the runs there. Uh, fourth inning, excuse me. Mariah, what did you see? First pitch swinging. Um, I was just looking for a great pitch to hit because I was a little bit excited because they walked the uh, batter before me, so I knew they wanted to come to me and pitch to me, so I was just looking for um, a pitch to drive to the green. And can you put into words how it feels? You had the game-winning hit to put your team in the championship game of the A-Sun tournament. Yep, uh, the center fielder made a great play on it. I had to give her credit for that, but uh, got some runners on base thanks to my great team, and uh, just so happy for Shelby Morgan, who pitched a great game and held them to no runs so that we can have the opportunity to win for just a hit in the air. And now looking forward, after all these years of waiting, it's been a four-year transition process. You're finally here. You've got a chance tomorrow to finally go to the NCAA tournament. What does that mean? It's such a blessing. We thank God for it every day. We're so excited to be here. We are, like, pumped up to just be at Atlantic Sun Conference, and to be in the championship games means everything to us. That's what we worked all year for, so we're very happy to be here. Great game. Great win. Congratulations, Mariah. Thank you very much, John and Mariah. And let's head it back to John. You can see he's shaking hands with the head coach, David Diros. And let's Joined go now by FGCU head coach Dave Diros and coach uh, – nip and tuck really the whole way and you get the big hit there in the third inning or fourth inning two out hits right yeah Stetson is so technically sound they're so fundamentally sound that it's just going to come down to who gets a break um, we played even all the way throughout and we the ones who got the break in that particular inning it's a tough break because Morella made a great effort to go ahead and get there you know it's just we got the break there and we took advantage of it and we've been talking about it all week you've been waiting 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 some more for this chance now you're here. Tomorrow you've got the chance to go to the NCAA tournament finally. What does that mean for you and for this program that you've built? Uh, it's, it's been a long time in coming. Um, we've had some good teams over the years, and they've, built the, they've laid the foundation down for what we're doing right now. We don't get the kids that we have right now in our program unless we have been successful in the past. And we were successful at Division II. We've been successful in our four years at, D, at uh, D1 and in the Atlantic Sun. So it's a credit to all the kids that we've had in our nine years before this one. And looking ahead tomorrow, are you there mentally at all to what it will feel like if you if you get it done and get to take the team there? Uh, I'm not even thinking about that because we have three possible opponents, three possible scouting possibilities. I'm just happy that we got through. We don't have to play anymore today, and we can go ahead and relax and get our minds right and ready to go. We celebrate this one, enjoy it, and then we'll be ready to go later tonight. Congratulations. Good luck tomorrow. Thanks, John. Back up to you, Paul and Francesca.